So now they just uh a plane just crashed in uh Iran. A Ukrainian airline plane just crashed. I'm gonna tell you what I think about that. Well I, I looked at the footage of the crash, but it was strangely that somebody was there documenting the crash. And um no I noticed that the video started from when the plane was already on fire, so it's possible the plane could have been hit by a small missile or something like that, or it had a malfunction. It's one or the other. But this plane crashed, and it killed all 180 people. And strangely, uh, Ukrainians can't be considered by Iranians as uh, U.S. allies. You understand what I mean? Or being that Iran is controlled by Russia, and Russia right now got you know, a foothold in their military, that could have been a, a strategic move for Russia. Like, let's blow these Ukrainians up. They could have possibly sabotaged the plane before it took off, knowing that the flight was going to take place. Or they uh, shot it down with, like, a small small uh, anti-aircraft weapon. But ultimately, the truth going to come out about this, and it's strangely that now we got a U.S. Uh, base attack and then now a plane went down all within a few hours apart. I mean, this is on, and, the, and it's, it's going nuts. The armies of uh, Gog and Magog. It was written in prophecy. And, you know, for those who follow scripture, they know what all of this means. This 